Let's go. That's a nice one. Check this out, guys. Welcome back to another episode. So today, I'm going to be doing something different. I did a video on how to catch crappie on these. Let me take this out really quick. On these gulp minnow um, alive. These are the one inch. They work really good and they stink really bad. So if you guys are wondering why I have a paper towel in there and I keep th these bait in this little Ziploc bag, it's because they stink. But today I want to do a video on how to catch or I don't know, panfish, I guess, how to catch panfish using these little gulp minnow. So stay tuned. I'm going to show you guys what I do. All right. If you guys haven't yet, please subscribe to my channel. We do a lot of fishing here and hit that thumbs up. We're almost at 500 subscriber guys. I'm pretty stoked about that. It's not a lot, but it's enough to hype me up. So stay tuned and we're going to get on some fish. All right, so you just pick one. You want to pick the most good looking juicy one. I'm just kidding. They all, they all look the same, guys. And you want to get a small jig head. I'm not, I'm not really sure what size that is, but it's pretty small. Uh, you can get it from the panfish uh, section or I believe I bought these hooks when I when I was buying crappie lures so a long time ago so this is why I keep this towel here I need to put a new one in there this one's pretty damp I wrap it up and then I'll seal the bag because trust me you don't want this stuff getting all over your tackle or in your backpack whatever you use to carry your arsenals all right put that there so this right here guys is your presentation you want to make sure that your line is straight up just like that that way that way when it hits the water it will stay like that just kind of like a kind of like a minnow swimming in the water Last time we were here, we were using trout magnet, and we did pretty good. So I'm pretty confident we're going to catch some panfish here. Oh, we caught some salad. So pretty much all I'm doing, oh, I got a bite already. Oh, come on. All I'm doing is casting as far as I can with my ultralight setup. And then you just slowly jig it. Got a little line tingle here. You know, last time I was here, the water was not this dirty. Ooh, something just wiped at it. Oh, come on. All right, I'm getting bite, guys. We're gonna catch one here soon. I know this place is just loaded. Oh. See, you know, you know your lure is getting bit when it comes back looking like that. Then you gotta fix it. Let's go. That's what I'm talking about. Check that out, guys. A nice little panfish here. Uh oh. Alright, he's gone. He's gone. Nice quick release. You want to make sure you have a really good, nice ultralight rod when you're throwing these really light lures. And you want to go light on your on your line. I got a four pound test line on. 
an ultralight. This is the St. Croix Trout Series rod. Oh, I felt it already, right when it hit the water. There we go. Now we're talking. This guy swallowed it, look at that. Man, I'm gonna need to tie a new one on soon. Let's go, let's see what this is. Looks like a bluegill. So right here guys, this is the setup. Gulp minnow with the jig head. I want to move down a little bit more. All right, let's go. All right. Let's go. What is that? I think these are red breasts, guys. Red breast sunfish. I believe that's what they're called. Come on. Check that out. I just saw something swiped at it. It looks pretty big. And I was just doing this. Just jigging it right straight down. Let's go. I told you guys. A bowhead, man. Come on now, let go. All right, check that out guys. A little bullhead. Let this guy go. All right, so we call some panfish and a bullhead. Ooh, let's go. Look at this little guy. Check that out guys, beautiful little fish. Let's go, that's a nice one. Another bowhead. Dang, this place is just loaded. All right, bowhead number two. There's a lot of people here, so I don't really want to talk so much. Let's go. Feels like a bluegill. Oh, it's a pike. Oh, no. Let's 
so slimy. Check that out, guys. Tiny little pike, man. All right, you guys. So that is a wrap. Uh, there was too many people there. I didn't want to make an outro, and that's pretty much. That's kind of why I didn't talk a lot. Normally, I try to, I try to talk a lot in my video as much as I can to keep you guys entertained. But if you guys made it this far, thanks for watching this video. And as you guys can tell, those uh, goat minnow, man, they work really good. I was really impressed and dude we actually caught a northern too that was really that was surprising and a bunch of bullhead i hate touching bullhead but we caught a bunch of them and a lot of panfish so if you guys like this video video please hit that thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and yeah i am on my way home right now to edit this video and as always i'll see you guys next time and fish eat sleep